Alec, and we are here at Hennessy, just outside Houston, Texas. Beautiful sunny day, and we've got an objective. Today we have the brand new Cadillac Escalade V and a Ram TRX, both totally stock. So we're gonna line them both up, see how they perform in a head-to-head -head race and a roll race. Uh, Alec will be in the Cadillac, I'll be in the TRX. We're gonna race from here to the horizon. All right, so we are in the 2023 Cadillac Escalade V. From the factory, it's got 682 horsepower and 653 pound-feet of torque from a supercharged 6.2 liter V8. They sticker for just around 150 grand, but dealer markup and market adjustment is a very common thing. So this one was actually a little bit more. Today in the race, we've just got it set in sport mode. We're gonna brake torque it. Our camera guy is gonna wave us down so we get a pretty even start. Okay, so I am in a 100% stock TRX. That means it's got a 6.2 liter supercharged Hemi under the hood, just over 700 horsepower, well over 600 foot-pounds of torque, standard all-wheel drive. My only concern is once we hit 80, 90 miles an hour, aerodynamically, it is a pickup truck, and I think the SUV is a bit sleeker, and that may help him as speeds increase. We're gonna see how things go. truck length and this is a big truck pretty quick <laughs> I called it I knew I'd get him off the dig and I did he's gonna come back and say hang on a sec you better jump on me Mike I didn't get a jump I'm just watching Going to box of Kleenex Let's roll into one. From what, 10, 20 miles an hour? What do you want to do? Yeah, let's do 20. Okay, okay. so I'll come, come up, up next to you. you. And you do the count. One, two, three, go. transmission in the Cadillac. It's a 10 speed. You know, the 10 speed is great for fuel economy, but it could be hurting you as far as how often it has to shift. You know, I've got an eight speed automatic. Maybe that's my advantage. That's what it feels like when you punch the gas on this thing. It's almost like it's questioning, am I really supposed to get moving? But once it makes up its mind, then it's like game on. Let's line up again and do it again from a standstill. Okay, I'll give you the jump and I'll go once you go. How's that? Oh my gosh, <laughs> that was neck in neck. Uh, when I give you that little extra, you know, millisecond that your transmission bulks, it's dead even. It's almost like once the transmission decides that it's go time, it levels the playing field. Reality is, is that the transmission of the TRX gives the advantage to the TRX, especially in a real world drag race where two cars are just lined up at a stoplight. But, you know, by the numbers, and once you hit 10 miles an hour and both cars are rolling, they're literally dead even. I mean, I do have to say the inside of this car puts yours to shame. <laughs> yeah, probably. It is a Cadillac. Also, what's your sticker price? I'm sorry, I didn't hear that you were breaking up. <laughs> yeah, I'll see you back at the shop. Came here for the horsepower. 